Hello. If you've ever been creating a PowerPoint presentation and used a custom font that you've got installed on your computer at home, perhaps, but which isn't installed on a computer at school or the workplace or wherever you're doing your presentation, you may well find that your fonts appear completely wrong. That the wonderful appearance that you came up with uh, suddenly ends up being replaced with a very boring standard sort of font and you've lost the impact. How do you make sure that your presentation keeps the fonts that you have used, even if they're only available on your own computer? How can you embed fonts in PowerPoint? So in this video, I've used a font here called Remachine Script uh, by Monos Griebach. Um, I think that's how you pronounce his name. Um, I'll put a download link to this font in the description below if you're interested. But this font has only been installed on my home computer. So if I was to package this uh, PowerPoint presentation up and take it to uh, my workplace, then uh, the font would probably be replaced with some standard font and it would just look completely different. So if I want to keep the appearance of this particular presentation, then I have to embed the font in the presentation itself. There are two ways of doing this. So first of all, I head up to File and then click on Save As. Now, when I go to the Save As menu, and we come to, to this area where we're choosing um, what we're going to call it and its format and, and where we're going to keep it, what we need to do is just look down here at the bottom right where we've got a little Tools drop-down menu next to the Save button. If I click on that Tools menu, I come down to Save Options. Click on Save Options, and here in the PowerPoint Options panel, in the Save section, right at the bottom, we have this option to embed fonts in the file. Now, if I tick that box, these two options become available. The first one will only embed those characters I've actually used. So if it's not going to be edited at all, at the place where the presentation is being shown, then that's the best option. It'll mean that your overall file size is a little smaller. However, if you think you might need to edit the file or somebody else might need to edit the presentation at some point uh, where you're taking it, then you can option here to embed all characters. So you embed the entire font in this presentation so that you can carry on editing it, adding new titles and using that font as though it was installed on the destination computer. Uh, that will mean that your file size will be bigger, but it will allow you to retain the appearance of your presentation. So that's how to embed fonts in a PowerPoint presentation. I hope you found that useful. If you did, please do consider giving this video a thumbs up. And it would also be terrific if you could subscribe. That would be marvellous and I would really appreciate that. Thank you. Um, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.